So we back at it again. This is Justice, aka the 901 Food Star. Uh, we at Chef Tam's underground restaurant. Uh, I've been hearing a lot of people say that it's been good. It's been schmacking, so we finna see. It's cold, so I ain't finna be out here and keep doing cut, take scenes. We just want it done in it. Want it done. What we got? I might take a comb. No. Nope. I am Kira. I be y'all waitress for the afternoon. Y'all wanna start with something to drink? Yeah, y'all so, got like lemonade. I was just gonna say, you know, we got homemade lemonade. Yeah, tell me the recommendation. So, period. So, they Chef Town's famous little Bruce's juice is they fire. You got wild berry, you got strawberry, you got watermelon, you got prickly pear, it's one of my favorites. You got hurricane. Prickly pear? Yes. Right, yes. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get down. All right. So that's your favorite? Yes, one of my favorites. Let me see what you You got for. blood orange. You got mango, you got peaches. It sounds weird. I don't like orange. I don't, I don't like, like it's orange. not citrus. Mm. It's not like but it's you know, orange like, flavor. It's not orange flavor. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna do the prickly yes, pear because she recommended it. I got it. What flavor? Here's her one. spike lemonades, but the bar is currently closed, so it's not spiked. <laughs> this is the one that she recommended the the Bruce's juice. She named it after her dad, mm. Bruce. And it's, it's pear flavor. Prickly pear. It's not prickly actually. Pear. It's a Hispanic fruit, actually. Oh, prickly mm -hmm. pear. Yeah. What another thought? Right. Oh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> it would have been good if it had some tequila. But I mean, it's good as, you know, Look, you want to bring it. It's good for seven and four. You want to come up here and cheers with your kid? Come up here and get the prickly pear. Two of my favorite appetizers that are on the menu, the fried catfish tacos and the volume fries. It's the loaded shrimp fry, the pico de nayo on it, the shrimp. Now, I've the seen bacon. them. I've they seen them. Fire. I'm it's not a taco itch. I don't want to say it on the camera. I'm a burrito itch. I like me a Those burrito. So I think them bayou fries I've been hearing, you can go ahead and put them in because I've been hearing all. that they've been good. And I'm Kira, by the way, Kira. I'm y'all waitress for the afternoon. Y'all let me know if y'all need anything. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You're welcome, boo. Catfish taco. Now that's some good stuff right there. Caught myself. Zoom in on that. Somebody granddaddy back there. Last week it was somebody grandma, somebody granddaddy back there right now. It's a nice little girthy taco, you know. It's a flower taco, but you know, it's still a taco. It's hot. Mm -hmm. That's a good, crispy catfish. That ain't no swad, none of that. That's real catfish. Two for two? And two for two. That's all you're gonna need is a two for two. And this is an appetizer? <laughs> Throw one more on the plate, this is gonna be a meal. Mm. Put on a little salt. A little, little sprinkle me, baby. I need to make one that's called Pick Me Up, Daddy. Did I say that? Oh, God. Yeah, you won't get canceled. Oh, God. I'm so worried. Somebody tried to cancel me last week, but I'm back. So we got okra. You wanna see that? It could be seasoned more. You want some good okra? Go to Dixie Queen on Austin Peak. What about it? It's good though, it's fresh. Catfish. And muddy mac and cheese. I'm excited to taste this. You're allergic to, to um, seafood, but you love mac and cheese, don't come up here. Because I don't think they make a separate batch for you people. <laughs> you people. Don't cancel me. 
<laughs> you be. <laughs> you don't cancel me. I'm pretty sure it's it's not legal, but I guess that's why they got the spring on me, baby, for this. It looked like a lot, but it might be good. <laughs> Just sprinkle that on your fish. This is for fish and chicken product. Not okra. I thought we waited long enough. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely tasting the farm raised. Um, <laughs> it's definitely good. It's seasoned well. You can see. Let's see. Look at that. Look at that gorgeous crust right there. The steamage coming from it. It's a healthy fish. Mm. That's hot as the mother. That's good. I'm pretty sure she got her own own meal back though. Own family recipe. She need to give it to me because I'm a part of the family now. I'm finna get a good review out of this one. I wanna put her hot sauce on it, but it's too hot for me. Spice of life, not in my life. We ate at Chef Sam's. Everything was good. I could say the okra could be a little bit more seasoned. But everything else, catfish, fire, catfish tacos, fire, bayou fries, fire, muddy bag and cheese, fire. Everything was delicious. So, um, yeah. I need to do another one too. A little extra. I don't know what else to say. It was good. It was fire. <laughs>